Guys, earlier we were talking about ways to make sure you get that fresh Christmas tree, but what we want to do is keep it that way. Paula Parr is with us this morning. Again, we're at Garden Valley uh, Farmer's Market. Paul, let's talk about when you pick that tree up from, from shops such as yours, from the farm, right? You want to make sure that they cut it and, and, and create a new fresh cut on the bottom. Right, right. So when, when they cut the trees up in the mountains, your bottom will it'll, it'll kind of dry up so it right. won't receive any water. So you want to make sure you get an inch and a half, two inch fresh cut on the bottom so that your tree can continue to drink. Um, once you get that fresh cut, get it in get it in water right away and let it, you know, let it absorb as much water as it can. Um, and then uh, you know So so when you do that, now let's show show right here. I want to the difference this here. Is, you yeah. got, this, this is a fresh cut here if we can see this. You can see how white it is versus the other side where the cells have closed up. And that's what we want to see on the tree is that nice white That nice white look, Because yes, that sir. means the cells are open and straight to absorb exactly. all that water. Exactly. Right, so once we have that tree up, products such as this, a little tree additive, is yeah. a good thing to use to, to, to help open, keep those cells open and keep that tree pulling that water in. Right. This is one of my favorite things. Basically, it's just tree fertilizer. Mm -hmm. And uh, like any, anything, any flowers, anything like that, you know, they need fertilizer. So you use this twice, two to three times a year um, for the span of your, you know, the lifespan of your tree. Yeah. And uh, you'll notice your tree be greener. It won't be as dry when you pull it out and it'll just be healthier all around. And it obviously won't dry out as quickly, which is, which is uh, a safety, you know, it, it's, it's. Absolutely. Uh, it, the other key is to always make sure there's water in that. In, exactly. In the sand. Exactly. You don't want to let your tree dry out because once you let your tree dry out, you give the bottom an opportunity to close, up, close up. And if it closes up, then you're going to, have to take all your ornaments off your tree, take it down, yeah. recut it so yeah, it can start drinking that. water again. So, all right, guys, <laughs> just some simple tips there. Make sure they cut it and use an additive, and that tree will last all the way through the holidays. Definitely.